Only hippopotamus will do. That's my favorite Christmas song. I knew it was gonna be a great day when that came on my Pandora as like the second or third song this morning. So it's gonna be a great Tuesday. I'm actually really excited for today. We are in Vlogmas Day 12, and it's a very special day because we are doing a collab with Keiko Cupcake, and she has sent me a box of clothing. We did a clothing swap, so I sent her, we decided on four to five items, and yeah, so basically I sent her her own Dia box, but out of my closet, and she has sent me some clothes I have not opened the box yet so we're gonna do that when I get home tonight and then we'll do a try on I was looking through my bedroom today and I was like oh my gosh I have like five try ons to do so this week might be fashion week <laughs> we could do Keiko cupcake today Dia tomorrow we could do swack on Thursday oh I hear oh, there he is I was like I hear a siren so we'll do SWAC on Thursday and Old Navy on Friday, maybe. Like, depending on how much I can get done at once. Um, I have some big stuff coming up this weekend. So, whew, your girl is a little stressed. But I'm gonna make it. So, I think I decided since I did not get that Ulta Star advent calendar out, that we'll just do that one and I'll just give the prizes away. Um, I think it's fun to open these advent calendars. I don't know, maybe I'm weird, but it's a kind of a nice way to like wrap up the day and talk to you guys about what's gone on and what to expect in the next day. So I kind of like it. Hi guys, so I'm home from work. I'm so excited. I'm gonna open my Keiko cupcake box. <laughs> Now, if you guys don't know, Keiko Cupcake, Erica is her name. She is one of the sweetest and most adorable people I've ever met. <laughs> so we are right around the same size. She's smaller than I am, I can guarantee it. But she's also done an amazing job of losing like close to 100, either 100 pounds or close to 100 pounds in like a year. Maybe even shorter than that. Um, she's just, I can't say enough good things about her. There's my scissors. And she's a gamer girl like I am. And so we just kind of connect. We have mutual friends. So it's, it's fun. Uh, she lives in Ohio in case I didn't mention that. I don't want to show any addresses. Okay. She did much better than I did. I don't think I even included a note in mine. And she included a card in hers. Oh my god, because she's so amazing. You are one of a kind. Look at this card. Um, I love it. Hey girl, thanks for being a sweet friend. Hope one day we can meet in person. Hope you like the clothes, but if not, just pay it forward. Merry Christmas, Erica. Let's dig in. Okay, the first thing I see looks like a kimono type cardigan. It's got a really pretty print on it. It's from Lovesick. I miss Lovesick so bad. I am so sad that I only got in like right when they were closing. I didn't even know about them until then. <laughs> ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh gosh, I hope this fits. This is a Torrid 5. It looks like a Grecian goddess dress. If I haven't already, if I hadn't already promised my sister that, well, okay, no, no, no. Let me go back. I bought matching dresses for my sister and I to wear to Christmas because my mom used to do that to us all the time, make us wear matching clothes. She's allowing me to do it. <laughs> all right. Piece number three looks like a really pretty skirt. Wait. Is it? Oh, it's a wrap skirt. I was like, wait, what? It's a wrap skirt. Oh, it's pretty. 
I love this floral detail on it. Oh my god, she sent me so much stuff. Alright, the next thing is this. Aw, this is a Torrid 6. It's this navy blue sweater with butterflies. So pretty. Alright, and this is, these look like knit leggings. They're also from Torrid. They're like a sweater knit legging. That seems like it'd be super warm and super cute. Oh my god, sequins y'all. It's a sequin skirt. And it's from Society Plus. I love Society Plus, you guys. So it's this matte sequin skirt. Oh, I'm so excited. All right, let's get some of these clothes on because I can't wait any longer. Here's what I was wearing before. <laughs> this is the leggings from Walmart, and this is an ASOS, or a sweatshirt dress from ASOS. So that's what I was wearing to work today. Okay, so we've got the sweater leggings on, which are so comfy, and this really cute sweater. I think it all fits really nicely. I like this sweater a lot. What do you guys think? Um, <laughs> these will have to be worn under a dress because I'm pretty sure you can see my underwear. But I don't have a problem with that. <laughs> like, at all. Okay, here is the sequin skirt. I think it's really pretty. You can roll it up to shorten it up. I threw this tank top on just because. Actually, let's... Here's that really nice kimono. <coughs> I like this a lot. It's really classy and just really pretty. All right, here is, I don't know, the boho skirt, I would call it. It definitely hits the ground. It does wrap around, but it's connected. I just think it's so like, pretty and <laughs> everything's pretty okay everything's pretty but it's like <sighs> what word am I trying to think of I just like it okay I think it covers things up and I can wear a long shirt over it or a shorter shirt and it'll be okay because it covers my tummy I like it I'd like to thank the Academy. It's an honor to even be nominated, but to win is the best. <laughs> Sorry, this feels like an Oscar gown or something. Like it's so beautiful and like flowy and flattering. I love this dress <laughs> so much. It hits the ground, but in like a really, like just skims. I know you guys can't see that, but I love this. I love it so much. <laughs> well, what did you guys think? What was your favorite piece? I'm in love with this dress. I think it complements my skin tone. It's very flattering on my figure. I'm like super happy with it. <laughs> like, I'm not sure where I'm going to wear it, but I'm going to wear it. Ooh. And that Jeffree Star lipstick we got yesterday might look really nice with this. We might be styling this for a holiday party later. <laughs> Not that I have any more holiday parties to go to, except on Saturday where I have three. This is my annoyed look. <laughs> so much going on, but at least I have a place to go. And so I am very thankful for that, that I have a place to go and a family to go see. And if you don't, I, I'm really sorry. And I hope that you can reach out to some friends or some friends reach out to you and you can share the holidays together. So, and again, I, I said this in a vlog earlier, but like, this is the time of year to maybe forgive some stupid shit. 
to maybe think about why you fell out with someone and think, is it, is it worth it? Is it worth not having that person around in your life? And if it is, that's fine. There are many people that I am glad I don't have in my life anymore. But to those people that you're like, man, I really miss them, reach out. You might be surprised. And what do you have to lose? All, the, all they're going to say is, no, I still don't want to talk to you. And then you're in the same boat as you were before, but at least you tried. And that's all that matters. So I have some dishes to do, some dinner to make. I have a little bit of paperwork that I have to get done. And my sister reminded me, well, my phone reminded me too later, that Logan has a program at school tomorrow um, in the evening. So I will be driving up for that probably. He is, he's in the school play and I can't remember what he told me he was. He's like a tree or a piece of corn or something. <laughs> I can't remember what he told me. He doesn't have a speaking part, but he's, he's in the play. And he's so excited about it. Like, <laughs> all the speaking parts went to like fifth and sixth graders or something. And he just kept telling my sister, maybe they'll give me a speaking part. There's still time. There's still time. Maybe I'll have a speaking part. And I'm like, yeah, you could for sure. Because you're awesome. <laughs> so I'm excited to see him and see him in his first play. So. Um, I will see you guys in a little while for the end of the night stuff. And yeah, I, I hope <laughs> I hope you guys liked some of the clothes. Um, make sure you go over to Erica's channel, of course, and see what I sent her. I've already seen one of the dresses I sent her on Instagram where she was wearing it and she looked so good. So good. So, all right, I'll see you guys later. All right, so... I have the fan on in my room if that's if you hear that a couple things I wanted to talk to you guys about so right now I'm watching my friend Tiana play Subnautica I will link her down below her name on Twitch is Cat Sack I don't know it's funny or it's Cat's Sack that's why we're friends is because we're both like that kind of girl <laughs> but anyway I was at the bank today because it's payday and the checker at the drive-thru had like a f ugly Christmas sweater or whatever and it had this big gorilla on it and I looked at him and I was like is that a Harambe sweater and he's like no no just a gorilla and I was like I got you <laughs> I was like I got you boo I got you <laughs> oh gosh <clears throat> no I just I opened my computer to download my um, my memory card and what I like to do is I like to go on Twitch and I like to support my friends that are on there because the more views you get or the longer people watch you you know you're more likely to get more followers blah 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 more likely to end up on the trending page things like that <clears throat> and so every time I'm online I like to at least have one of them open in the background just so someone's getting views while my computer's opening and running anyway so it's a nice thing to do for people. Um, they probably don't even notice because I, we call it lurking. So you're just like in the background. You're not necessarily talking to anyone. So yeah, I'm going to go do my chores now. <laughs> I just, I had remembered that and I wanted to tell you guys that. And I swear there was something this morning that I wanted to tell you and I can't remember. Yeah, I don't remember. Anyway. I don't even know what I'm doing anymore, but I'm not tired today. So I wonder what the difference is. I wonder, gosh, I, I wonder if it's my meds because <clears throat> I'm not pregnant. Someone asked that there's no way I'm pregnant. I have an IUD and I was just pregnancy tested the last time they did that scraping. I'm good. I swear. <laughs> like that's no, can't happen. But, um, yeah, I don't know why I'm so t why I had been so tired, and I was I was joking with Xavier. He's like, "Get your iron levels checked." Well, I'm always iron deficient. It like runs in my family, so I do take an iron pill. <clears throat> but I was like, "No, I'm just 
it's the vitamin D, and I know it is. I, I know it's got to be the vitamin D. Like, the sun hasn't been out for like 40 days or something. <laughs> but I'm sure that's what it is. It's <coughs> shorter days and stuff. So, hopefully. But today I don't seem to be tired. And maybe it's because I didn't come home and lay down. I came home and I got stuff going. So maybe I just need to, like, keep the momentum from work going when I get home instead of taking some time to, like, chill and relax before I get some stuff done. Hmm. You guys know that we're, we all think together, so. Anyway, I'm actually going to go do something more, so. My eye makeup held up really well today. Huh. I'm actually surprised because all I did was my eyes again. I used the Modern Renaissance palette and my eyeliner was Wet n Wild and my mascara was It Superhero. If you guys can get your hands on this, this is so good. Um, I think Ulta has, they have the full size but they also have like the trial size and I first had the trial size and then I got this one in like I think BoxyCharm and I was like yes because I was going to buy it but it cosmetics is a little bit on the higher price side they're not generally like um a what am I trying to say they're not a drugstore one so okay so while my dinner is finishing cooking I will I'm gonna do this haul from New Chic so New Chic contacted me and asked if I wanted to do a haul from them and I was really hesitant because I've done Rose Gal, I've done Zoffel a couple times, and their clothes definitely don't work out. And some of the other stuff is sketchy. Like, let's just be honest. It's a little sketchy. So I was like, I mean, I guess I'll try it. I go, I'm going to be brutally honest. And, you know, I don't really want to try a bunch of clothes because those never work out for me. And I would like to try, like, accessories or makeup. And she's was totally cool with that. So, that being said, the first two items are clothing. But these are the only two. So, I forgot to look these up before I did this. Um, I will have on the screen or in the description all the links for this stuff. Oh, this is a jacket. I don't know what that is. Um, it's this fuzzy where's the top fuzzy hooded jacket right and it says it's a 5XL so oh my god it actually fits wow oh and it has pockets um, <laughs> I'm gonna get out of my own way here so the jacket actually fits um, it's not great, like, high quality or anything, but it'd keep you warm. There's no zippers or anything, which I kind of prefer. It's super warm, though, and super soft. So, the this 5X is a true 5X. Um... Here's the brand. That's really the only thing that is in here. Um, hand wash or machine wash. Tumble dry. So, um, like I said, the fabric's not the greatest. Like, it's not super thick. Like, I can sort of see through it, but... It's comfy, but it is shedding a lot. <laughs> but I'm actually really happy with that. Like, yeah, I am. Oh wait, is there three clothing items? Looks like three clothing items, sorry guys. I do like that all the clothing comes in these plastic bags and I'm not getting like a super chemically smell like when they come out of the bag, like sometimes you would get. All right, this is that same brand. I love this detail. 
So it's like a peasant top with bell sleeves. This is supposed to be a 5X2, but it's this fabric that has no stretch. So... It's not going to go over my chest. I mean, if I wanted it to be a crop top... <laughs> actually, you guys... If you had a cute cami, and this is how you wanted to wear it, I think that would work out. <laughs> like, it's not tight, like, on my arms or anything, but it's tight in the chest for me. But I, got, I really love this detail. I don't know. Like, it's not... Uh, hold on, here's some defects. Can you guys see that? So there's already stitching that's kind of coming out of it, and it, it doesn't work. Like, I mean, you could do something with it, but that's going to be a no-go. But we find that a lot, that these don't have stretchy fabrics from these overseas places. Now this one, I remember, I looked at, <clears throat> and it was Jersey. It's that same company. It's a 5X, so it's purple. It's got this really cute button detail on the side. And this uh, piping or whatever, it feels a little stretchy, but not, not a lot. So it's too tight, but it's not terrible. Like, I, you know, I bet I could wear this with a skirt. It's a little tight on my upper arms, but I have huge upper arms, we know. And I just think if this wasn't there, it'd be better. <laughs> it just makes me look blah blah. But I really like the sleeves. I don't know. The jacket worked. I always try to like find a silver lining in something or shit like that and sometimes you just can't. <laughs> okay, so here is the rest of my haul. They have a lot of the like weird and interesting products on their sites. And so this is one of those eyebrow pens. Remember I tried the one from Maybelline and it just didn't work. So, come on now. Why? Spongebob meme. Ten hours later. Jeebus. Finally. Okay, so I got the color 01, which is dark brown. So it's, okay. Looks like that. So it's supposed to mimic eyebrow strokes. It's not too bad. And I did that much without it, like, completely drying out like the Maybelline one did. I ordered this before I got microblading, of course. <laughs> but, you know, if I ever need a touch-up or something, this might work. I am going to store it upside down, though. Alright, this... Stylo four-color all-in-one pen. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah! This, too, is a brow product, I think. So it's one of those crazy pens that we had when we were kids. And it's got gray, dark brown, black, and light brown. And, yeah, it's it's like a brow pen. Ooh, that's, that's not bad, either. 
And so if you want a different color, boom, boom, boom. I think like benefit or somebody, oh, and then that's how you roll it up. It's genius. Like I might put this into use. Obviously I'm not gonna use the gray. I don't know, I might use the gray for like eyeliner. Is this eye safe? Like I don't even know. polyparabens. With four refills, the eyebrow pencil glides effortlessly to sculpt your eyebrows, creating natural, long-lasting effect. <laughs> Announcements. This product is just used for makeup. Please stop using if the product is inapplicable to you. I mean, yeah. Um, it doesn't necessarily say that it is not ice safe or that it is ice safe, but it is made in China. So, I don't know. I'll give, I'll give it a try one day. Okay, the next makeup product I have is these long-lasting eye and lip liners. So I know these are safe for the eyes, supposedly. <laughs> also made in China. So there is one, two, three, four, five, six, twelve in here. Lots of fun colors. So let me let me swatch these on my hand. Okay, here they are. So you've got a pink, kind of a mint, a bronze, a gold, blue, and like a magenta. And then up here you have silver this pearly green, black, red, pearl blue, and then pearl pearl. I actually really like these. They went on, they're like a gel pen, like a gel liner. Is that the right? Yeah. Um, they say they're eye and lip safe, so probably tomorrow I'll try to use these in a look because I'm really interested to see how they work. I'm going to put those aside. All right, so the next thing, well, let's, I got myself a set of brushes. I love makeup brushes. This is, doesn't say how many, there's quite a few in here, and there's some that are repeats, and I believe they're all for the eyes, maybe? I could be wrong. No, there's a foundation brush in here. But it's not a bunch of brushes you don't need. These are all like really good for eyes and stuff. And you can see that the handles are glitter and crystals. Um, they're really soft. They don't smell weird. There's a fan brush. Looks like that's a foundation brush. And this could be like a highlight brush. There's a spoolie. But the rest of them are like, to me, eye brushes. So, I love it. I like it, I love it, I want some more of it. So in the morning we will use those to do my face. Now we're moving on into skincare type stuff. So, I've been looking at serums and like acids and stuff that are good for your skin. And I got this set of three. So I got a vitamin C serum with 20% vitamin C and hyaluronic acid. I got a hyaluronic acid and snail secretion serum. And I got a six peptide serum in 24 karat gold, which has six peptides, hyaluronic acid, and collagen. So... The six peptides, the benefits, rich in such essential ingredients as six peptides and hyaluronic acid, this product reduces fine lines, prevents wrinkles, improves loose skin, lifts and moisturizes skin, keeps it firm and hydrated, and slows down aging. I want you to know that I didn't pick these from that site, like, blindly. I have been researching this kind of stuff for a couple months, okay? Not gonna lie, it was a couple months. And 
I had picked stuff out from The Ordinary on Shop Hush, and I just hadn't, like, pulled the trigger on it. And so when they offered to send me this stuff, I was like, yes, please. <laughs> so the benefits of the vitamin C serum has efficient whitening and freckle removing properties, making it capable of brightening and moisturizing the skin and removing stains and freckles. I don't necessarily want to remove my freckles, but I did notice that I'm getting like a dark spot next to my mole. And I can't tell you how long it's been there or anything. <clears throat> So then the Hyaluronic Acid Serum, snail secretion filtrates and sodium hyalur hyalurate are added so as to rejuvenate, moisturize, nourish, and lift the skin while making it firm. So I'm just trying to like keep my skin young and beautiful. Uh, I have good genes, but like eventually we all need some help because right now I don't do anything. <laughs> I wash my face in the shower and that's about it. So, every once in a while I do a mask, but, yeah. So this next thing, speaking of mask, is the Star Sky Moisturizing Firming Dead Skin Removal. I love the packaging. It is hollow. That's real hollow, right? Like, it shifts the whole rainbow. Isn't that what hollow is supposed to do? I don't know. Go ask Christine. Gosh. <laughs> If you guys don't know what I'm talking about, Simply Neological is Christine, and she is a hollow sexual. <laughs> she loves hollow everything. Oh, I forgot what this looks like. Oh my god, oh my god. Oh my gosh. They also send you an applicator, but I want to open this. <laughs> I threw the box away. Hold on. Calm down, Candy. Product efficiency. Remove the dirt and excess fat inside the pores. Make skin clear and clean. Reduces blackheads and acne. And effectively alleviates the pores due to obstruction and become thick. Continuous use can make the skin delicate and smooth so that the skin return to delicate and smooth. Helps your skin look smoother, tighter, and younger. Restore skin elasticity. How to use... Apply proper amount and spread evenly over the entire face, except around the eyes and mouth. After 20 to 30 minutes, remove the pack from remove the pack from the top to bottom when it is completely dried. So it's a peel mask. Some things did not translate exactly. So 20 to 30 minutes. Oh yeah. Okay, so it's like that inside. I'm actually going to leave the lid on this. We will come back to this later on tonight. Um, I want to eat dinner before I do a face mask. All right, the last thing is this poor sucker. Not P-O-O-R sucker. P-O-R-E sucker. So it's supposed to remove blackheads and things like that. multifunctional cleansing instrument I'm gonna move some of this stuff tips please operate on the back of the hand skillfully before use it on your face move from top to bottom during use do not stay in the same place this can cause redness of the skin it is recommended to use the Derived lotion or formant with warm water on the cleaning area before using the cleaner. What? It looks like it's supposed to slide out, but it won't. And there's no tape on it. Oh, come on now. There we go. Jeebus. I'm not going to throw that away because that looks like the only instructions. Great, so here it is. It looks scary. Yeah, that's the only instructions. So it comes with five little nozzles 
I think I might have to. Are they just pressure? Okay, yeah, they just are push-ons. You don't have to screw them in or anything. Easily on and off, no problem. Not sure what that's for. <coughs> I'm going to set this to charge and then we will come use that later also after I've eaten dinner so what we'll do is we will wash my face with whatever like I have face wash in the bathroom and then we'll come in and we will spot check some, some pores and then we'll do the peel off mask and then we'll do the serums. We're just going to put my face through the ringer and see what happens. If tomorrow my face is melted off, just know that I love you guys. And I hope that you will love me no matter what I look like. Well, that night went quicker than I thought. <laughs> it's 8 o'clock already and I like to at least start editing by now. So... Um, I went into the living room. I didn't want to disturb the Harry Potters, so I just took the new guy out. It's George. So now Fred and George are together. <laughs> I'm weird. Um, today's gift away winner is Nicole Shoot or Shut. Congratulations, Nicole. Let's see what we're going to be passing off. I know why I hadn't started this. Okay. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Everything's fine. Day 12. <gasps> la, 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 la. Oh my gosh, guys. It's a blush. Ooh, that's really pretty. This is called Lollipop Hop. Gorge. Ooh, Nicole, you so lucky. All right, the 12th. All right, from Makeup Revolution, we have an eye primer. I have never tried their eye primer. But Nicole, that's coming to you. That's awesome. I found some of the stuff in the Makeup Revolution is really useful stuff, which is nice. I spit. Um, I'm sorry. So, gosh. I still want to put on this mask. Like, oh, but I haven't washed my face. We're going to have to do this another day. That stuff another day. Um, I just, I need to go to bed soon. Like, I got to have this ready to go. So... Fred and George are gonna handstand up or headstand up here and watch me. And I will see you guys tomorrow for day 13. Um, my nephew Logan has a concert or play that I'm going to, so I'm not sure what kind of footage we're gonna have, but there'll be something. So I'll see you guys then. Oh, come let us adore him. Oh, come let us adore him. Christ the